first engagement. Word play is a, like sword play is like we move. It's like a, a duel. And when you say right, we're actually moving it to the right. Stepping to the side. Parry. Left. Disarm. Some people are disarmed. And then I realized when disarming an opponent, there's two ways you can do it. You can knock their weapon on the ground or take it from them. And if you do one of those two things in conversation, essentially disarming an opponent by taking something from them that they ha thought they had, by dismantling it quickly, you can... There's two ways to do it. If you're making eye contact, I think the thing to do is give it back. Offer it back to them, hand it to them, give it to them. You know, it, that's, it's not about any kind of destruction, it's about... But if you knock it on the ground, if you look away, if you're looking away and you make a, a, a kind of a twisting point in a conversation that catches someone off guard and they're, they're like, oh, and their weapon falls to the floor, their offensive capability to the floor... I say stay calm and let them pick it up. Look at the weapon if you want. Acknowledge it, at least in your own mind. Know what's going on. But let them do what they want. Two, to two whole different ways of... I was going to say two totally different types of communication, but it's two whole different ways of how to handle the disarming of an opponent. I think those are the best two ways, because then the conversation can continue. Well, I watched that video, and to clarify, um, I think every action we take verbally is related to a move of some sort, psychologically, if you want. You can imagine that kind of thing. So, literally to let them pick it up, off, let them pick up their weapon off the ground, is to let them start speaking. So if, you make, if you're looking away and you make a point that catches someone off guard, and they're like, oh, and, and they seem like taken aback or something, taken off guard, speechless, however you want to call it, Calmly let them pick it, pick it back up, because they will. If you're looking at them, and you say something that takes something from someone, and they're looking at you, say something else that gives it back. Make it something about them, give something to them, give them their capability. I like posts, video, uh, clarification slash collaboration. It's like I'm collaborating with myself to make a final edit.